Hello, I'm Andrew Evans. I'm the Welsh Government's Chief Pharmaceutical Officer. I'm a pharmacist and I'm helping prepare so that people can continue to get the medicines they need after the UK leaves the European Union. Our message to people is really clear. Keep ordering your medicines in the way you've always done, keep collecting them from the pharmacy in the way you've always done, and really importantly, keep taking them in the way they're prescribed for you. So in Wales, we're working really hard to make sure that if we leave the EU without a deal, medicines will still be available. That includes working with the UK government and working with the pharmaceutical industry to make sure there are additional stocks in the UK, to make sure there's an additional storage and freight capacity for medicines coming into the country, and making sure that where medicines need to come in, their supply is prioritised over other goods. So if there was a disruption to the supply of medicines, we've got really well established procedures already. So it's important people know that shortages of medicines occur already and that's nothing to do with leaving the European Union. But in the event that a medicine becomes uh, in short supply and people have difficulty getting it, people might notice the brand of the medicine they get changes or the strength or form of it is different. In some cases, patients might have to have a different medicine that has the same clinical effect. If people are worried or unsure about what to do in the event they can't get their medicines, they can always talk to their pharmacist. And if they want more information about how Wales is preparing for leaving the European Union, they can visit the Preparing Wales website.